Look, Bunch, I hope you know how I feel about all of you. We've had terrific times together, but you have to understand, it's hard for me to believe that my baseball career is over. But just think, Johnny, how lucky you are. You had a fantastic career, and it was all topped off by an incredible retirement day in Cincinnati. It's the neatest thing I've ever seen. Yeah, Johnny, Sam and I will have great memories of that day forever. Michelle's right, and you'll have great memories of that day too, Johnny. They rolled out the big red carpet in Cincinnati on Johnny Bench Day with a record regular season crowd of almost 54,000 paid tribute. A few of us were there as well to honor Johnny before his speech. I am a very lucky person. I am a very honored person and very grateful person. You have made this day complete. You have made it better than I could have ever written a script for. I thank you so much. My family thanks you. I appreciate you. And I'm going to try like hell to play good for you tonight. Thank you. Johnny did just that in the game against Houston, coming through in typical first-class fashion. Johnny brought down the house, and the fans showed how much they cared. Bunch, that really was an honor, and you're right, I'll never forget it. Yeah, Johnny, and you just weren't given a day in Cincinnati. You were given a day in every National League city. Johnny, you're loved by baseball fans everywhere. Yeah, those days were something special. I mean, the fans were so kind everywhere, and all those great presents. Uh-oh, now what did I say? Chicken's got everything. Oh. All right. <laughs> Thanks a lot, Chicken. I guess that now that I'm an old-timer, I've got to learn how to play this kind of baseball. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks for trying to cheer me up, guys. You've been a big help. That's what friends are for. Michelle's right, Johnny. I mean, where would Rosencrantz have been without Gildestern? Or Ralph Cramden without Ed Norton, right? Yeah, and Caesar without Brutus. Thanks, Sam. Well, forget about that one, Johnny. But you know what I mean. They say you can judge a man by the friends he keeps. And well, Johnny, you got some pretty good friends. I know baseball is going to miss him this year, and uh, he is, has been and will still be a great ambassador for the game of baseball, and I wish him nothing but the best. Thank you for being a friend. I'm going to thank you. Thank you for being a friend. Johnny Bench is the best, best catcher I've ever seen and probably ever will see. He's the greatest single player I've ever seen at one position. Great player, all the same. To me, uh, he was probably the best catcher that's ever played the game. Thank you, thank you for being a friend. I want to thank you, thank you for being a friend. In my opinion, there are catchers that hit and there are hitters that catch. John did both very, very well. Not only a fine ball player and a future Hall of Famer, but uh, to me, a very good personal friend, a fine man. Good luck to you in your retirement, and uh, Godspeed to the Hall of Fame. Well, Johnny, I'm going to miss you both as a competitor and as a friend. Uh, you did what you did better than any catcher I've ever seen. I guess I did make some pretty good friends. You sure did. Yeah, who wouldn't want to be your friend? Even him. Right you are, Bunch. Even me. I happen to have friends all over the universe. And I certainly count Mr. Jerry Bench among my Psst, most Johnny, treasured... Johnny Bench. Uh, uh, yes, I mean Johnny Bench. I've known Jerry, uh, uh, Johnny a long time. And as far as I am concerned, he was the best catcher the game has ever seen. I mean, the guys caught more men stealing than Kojak. Oh. And boy, could he block the plate. Why, the last time we went out to eat, the waitress couldn't even put a sandwich down. Oh. But that's not so surprising. That's the kind of player Mr. Bench was. Hard-nosed and tough. 
He never hesitated to take off his mask and stand his guard. And if you don't believe me, take a good look at him. He looks like he's just going the distance with Muhammad Ali. But seriously, Bunch, Mr. Bench is a credit to the game, and I, for one, will never forget him. That's why my word for today is memories. Memories I have of Mr. Bench, and Mr. Bench has of the game. Yes, memories. Nothing can replace them. So enjoy your retirement, Mr. Bench, while I leave you with these memories. 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 Enough, wizard. That's something I'll never retire from, turning him off. Hey, Johnny, you're smiling. I guess I am. And why shouldn't I be? You're right. I did have a great career. And you know something else? I'm going to enjoy my retirement. No more road trips, plane flights, or late night meals. Man, this is going to be great. That's right, Johnny. And you'll be able to spend more time with us doing what the baseball bunch does best. And that's... Play ball! Yeah! I guess I'm only semi-retired because I'll be here next week, and I hope you will be too, for more fun with the baseball bunch. Run? I'm not that old chicken.